In this video, uh, we will see a program for entropy and mutual information of a binary symmetric channel. Uh, this is the channel diagram for the binary symmetric channel where it is having two inputs x1 and x2 and two outputs y1 and y2. So this is called as a channel diagram. To write the MATLAB program, uh, here I have taken the input probabilities as uh, 0.5 for the input x1 and again 0.5 for the input x2. Uh, the messages are equiprobable. Uh, this is called as a conditional uh, probability matrix uh, which is having the value 0 0.6, 0 0.4, 0 0.4 and 0 0.6. This value is called as uh, P of Y1 by X1, the first value. And this is called as a P of Y2 by X1. And this one is P of Y1 by X2. And this is P of Y2 by X2. Uh, this is the formula to calculate the output uh, probabilities. Uh, that is P of Y1 equal to, the relation is written here. P of Y1 by X1 into P of X1 plus P of Y1 by X2 into P of X2. This is a relation to calculate the output probability. And uh, to calculate the joint probability matrix, uh, we have the formula P of Y by X into P of X. So using uh, these uh, formulas, we will be writing a MATLAB code. So here uh, the MATLAB code is written. Uh, initially, you need to write uh, this, these commands, uh, CLC, clear all, close all, and I is equal to input. Here, you need to enter the number of elements. So, in our case, the number of elements are 2, that is x1 and x2. And you need to enter the uh, probability of an input, uh, that is the input probabilities, which are 0 0.5 and 0 0.5. And you need to enter the conditional probability matrix also. Uh, I have already told uh, for this particular program, we'll be taking this matrix. Uh, here, uh, using the for loop, uh, we'll be calculating the entropy. Uh, entropy formula is there, that is uh, P log of 1 by P, that is probability of the input multiplied by log of 1 by P. So using this for loop, uh, you'll get entropy h of x. And here, uh, this particular for loop uh, will uh, give you the joint probability matrix. Uh, here I have written the relation for that. As we have already entered the conditional probability matrix, using that matrix and that will be multiplied with the input probability that gives the uh, joint probability matrix. Uh, similarly, we will uh, calculate the conditional entropy that is h of phi by x using this formula. And you can also calculate h of uh, y by x. For the probability p of y, uh, you need to use this relation and uh, this relation is written here in the MATLAB code to calculate the output probability. And uh, using the formula of entropy H of Y, uh, we'll be calculating the same. And for the mutual information, uh, we'll be using the formula H2 minus H1, where H2 is H of Y and H1 here is H1 is H of Y by X. So you'll get the mutual information. Uh, let us execute this code. So it will ask for enter the number of elements. So in our case, the number of elements are 2. Enter the probability, that is input probabilities. Uh, so the values are 0 0.5 and 0 0.5. Now you need to enter the conditional probability matrix. So whenever you are entering the matrix, you need to use a, a square bracket. Uh, to enter the first row values uh, that are entered like this, 0 0.6 space, 0 0.4, uh, 
to enter the second row values you need to use a semicolon so uh, once you enter the conditional probability matrix the remaining values are calculated uh, using the for loop that that we have written so we have the entropy h of x as 1 and uh, joint probability matrix values are like this so all the values are calculated suppose if you want to execute uh, the code for the different values of the matrix uh, you just enter the uh, file name to execute the code again it will ask for the uh, and number of elements like this uh, you can execute the code for the different uh, matrix values and the input probabilities thank you